Hello, hello, hello. Welcome or welcome back to My Peace is Priceless. Thank you for joining me today for another cash stuffing video. It is actually 6.30 in the morning and I decided to try to jump on real quick and do this video before I start work at 7. So let's see how this goes. Um, I thought it would be cool to save for an upcoming trip that I have at the end of June. Um, since I have to save for it, well, I don't have to save for everything, but for some of the categories I have to save, I said, why not incorporate it into my, um, cash stuffing, uh, um, videos. So that's what I'm going to do today. I already have some, uh, an envelope and a tracker and, um, I will let you know the categories that I am going to be saving for. So without further ado, let's get into it. I hope you all are having an amazing day. It is, like I said, 6.30 in the morning. So we have the whole day to make sure that um, our day turns out fabulous and amazing. So I hope that you all reach that. That is everyone's goal to have an amazing day. So let's get right into it. So I'll be travel traveling um, the end of June and it'll be for a week. And these are the one, two, three, four, four categories that I um, am going to be saving in my cash envelope for. Certain things have already been paid for, so I didn't bother to uh, put that down because it's already out the way and I don't have to think about it anymore. Uh, and these are the remaining things that I have to pay for. So um, I'll be traveling by bus and the round trip ticket for that is $102. We're staying at an Airbnb, so um, I'm gonna get some groceries and I've allotted $275 for that. I'll also be getting some items from the, the local market there. And I've allotted $100 for that. And for lifts, I use Lyft. I don't use Uber. Um, I've allotted $100 for that as well. So that is a total of, I believe... $577. Now with that, I want to have a cushion just in case I run over in any of these three categories. I don't really see um, me going over the lifts that much, but you never know. I know pretty much where I'm going and it shouldn't cost over $100, but there might be somewhere um, that we decide to go impromptu. Um, groceries is a catch 22, you know, prices are always going up. So I would definitely wanna make sure I have enough for those items. And and just anything else I may uh, wanna purchase, pocket money, whatever. So I'm also gonna allot $150 as a cushion and that's going to be a total of huh, $777. Let me just make sure my math is right. Um, $102, one dollars $275, $100, $100, and $150. Oh, no. That's actually $727. Okay. So I'm going to divide this amongst eight pays so that is ninety dollars divided by eight it's ninety dollars and eighty eight cents but we're going to round that up to the nearest dollar so in actuality it'll be 91 cents okay so my goal is to stuff Every pay, $91. I'm not going to stress myself if I don't have the $91 um, at that particular time. 
I will definitely make up any monies that um, I don't have by the end of the last um, cash stuffing, that eighth payment. I'm go I've decided I'm going to utilize rollload of money from my everyday cash wallet. And um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'll use whatever I haven't spent uh, in those envelopes and um, any additional monies that I come across like today. And I'll explain that in a moment. And obviously just, you know, budgeting out within my paycheck, the monies as well. So um, I decided to make this video today because I got some extra money. Well, I got some money for my birthday. My birthday was yesterday. And so I said, what a great way to utilize some of this money. So that's why I'm hopping up the bit, um, to make this video right now. So moving on. So since I don't have a lot of envelopes, or I'm, I'm trying not to have a lot of envelopes right now and a whole bunch of binders, I'm going to utilize my savings challenge uh, binder to house this savings challenge, this travel savings challenge. And I already have a tracker that I created a while ago for my self-care um, bundle. And I also have an, an envelope that I'm gonna use as well. So I'm going to put that in here and I'm gonna put it between savings challenge A and B. So this is the envelope that I'm going to use. It says travel. And this is the tracker that I'm going to use. Let me make that out of the way. So I made this a while ago, like I said, um, with, for my uh, self-care bundle savings challenge that I had. Um, the self-care bundle was uh, beauty, health, fitness, hobbies or R&R, &R, traveling, and shopping. So I just pulled out the, the, um, the traveler. Whoa, I can't talk. It's so early in the morning. The travel uh, tracker. And that's what I'm going to use for, for this challenge now. So... Um, where is my, so I, my daughter took my color pencils. She needed it for something. So I'm just going to use a highlighter and I am going to just highlight the first set of luggage, right? And let's see how much we're going to be saving today. Oh, I'm speeding because I'm trying to make sure I close out this video in time for me to log on for work. Let me put this to the side. Oh, so like I said, I'm gonna try to save $91, right? Okay, I already mentioned that. So back over here. So today, let's see how much cash we have. We have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, and 91. So we have our first Set of $91, and I didn't even have to come out of pocket for it, so we love that for us, right? So I'm just going to jot down 91. Put the money in the envelope, and I'll just put the tracker in front. Should I put it in front or behind? Let's see. This is how it looks in front of it. And this is how it looks behind it. Um, I like it both ways, but I, I must keep it this way for now. So there you have it, guys. I've incorporated um, one additional challenge 
to my binders and that's the travel binder for my upcoming trip in June. And the goal is to save $727 over an eight, um, eight pay period span. And I've already stuffed my first um, set for the eight. So one down and seven to go. So that's all for this video. Um, again, I hope you have a wonderful and amazing day. And until next time, you know what to do. Continue budgeting. Later.